Good morning and welcome to Destiny, the open door. I am your host, Tammy Dennis, and I come to you on today, Wednesday, with our online daily inspiration and journey into the presence. Today, one of the most interesting aspects of the day is that you're in life. God woke you up this morning. The sun is shining on you today. Whatever is going on in the realm of family, thank God he allowed you to see another day to be able to bless them with your presence, right? (laughs) Yes. Thank God for the love of thyself for the healing of thyself. Thank God for the love of family too, right? Yes. And thank God for the presence of God in you and also in me. Because on today, the mercies of God is upon us and the masters of light and life bring to the planet earth the qualities of healing truth the supply of God of a thousand suns and consecration which is all precipitation of these powers of life being wielded to the planet in these areas of the abundance of precipitating the blessings from the masters to be brought forth. As you stand to accept these governing powers and bring into life the actions of these qualities to bless you. To bless your loved ones and communities in which you have taken action to make the calls to the presence of your life, the blessings to the planet must come the blessings to the planet, to the community, to the loved ones, and also to you must come. They cannot fail because the great I am only knows perfection. It operates in perfection only. It is the perfected being that stands in position nine inches in diameter above your head. Just like that luminosity glow over Jesus' crown with the illumination of the sun presence, so too does every human being have that same sun presence above them that extenuates down through the silver cord and attaches itself very deeply inside of the sacred heart chamber 
and your heart. On the band of light where healing is projected down to our planet, we find the fifth ray legions of light who operate in the color spectrum of emerald green. The Elohim of healing is beloved Cyclopia, who is in charge of the healing rays to the earth. The ascended host of the light gives each of us assistance and we must utilize the daily practice of learning our own soul self consciously. Being mindful and aware of our emotions of self, this is the way and means by which the heavens assist us in the healing process. The healing process of our bodies and assisting others also. Let us state our preamble on today. It is going to be different from the other days because I'm being led by the masters of light. (laughs) And as they bring forth that light of instruction, I am so charged to act on their behalf. So our preamble for today is this. In the name of my beloved mighty, I am presence. Higher mental bodies of all mankind, all great legions and powers of light. We call forth the legions of light from the fifth ray band of light to give to this planet the most intensified light that shall sweep, sweep, sweep Sweep, 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 sweep through the atmosphere and magnetize and radiate every life form on this blessed planet. Come. Come, come, come in your visible, tangible, ascended master bodies. We ask for the same healing for the elemental kingdom. We ask for the same healing for the oceanic kingdom, the animal kingdom, and humankind. In a special way that they know and feel that God is acting here and now and that he is ever present upon the earth. Our beloved seven mighty Elohim of the light, the seven Chohans of the light, the seven archangels of the light. Come Come, come, come to work, a mighty work in the realm of protection and of healing for the entire planet now. And Saint Germain and Archangel Zagheel shine forth the violet ray 
throughout the earth to bless all those who desire change and who want a better way of life on today in the body, mind, soul, and spirit of them. And our decree declaration for today is the healing contemplation of thyself. I am the Christ presence within me, drawing through the magnetic power of its love into the full realization and acceptance of my divinity. I do now abide within that presence and I am its full momentum, its full manifestation of perfection right now. My mortal consciousness is now centered within the sacred fire, within my heart and there I am There I am at one with the divine concept of my very own perfection, which shall now be made manifest through me, the sacred fire within my heart is now expanding with full power and all its beauty and perfection through every center within my body. And I shall now attain full use and mastery over all the inner faculties and their centers of force within me. Beloved I am. Beloved I am. Beloved I am. And our healing chalice comes out of the Bridge to Freedom book, 2, page 123. And it states, Beloved children of my heart, think now, not with the mental consciousness, but with thy heart consciousness, which is my consciousness within thee the flame of thy true being, thy immortal identity, is that which you know and understand as I am. Thou and I are the divine one. I am thy father, mother, the Holy Spirit within thee is the flame breath of my being made manifest in my creation. I have fashioned thee from the substance of my love and light and thou art indeed made in the image and likeness which I am. I am the divine creator. It must follow that thou art a divine creation, endowed with the fire breath of thy creator's own being. Thy true being is the beauty and perfection of my handiwork. 
and thou art indeed good, small children of thy mortal kingdom. In their innocence and truthfulness, trustfulness, and go forth in their adventures with life and often fall and abuse the delicate flesh. How often the child in his wrath turns and strikes at the impediment over which his own clumsiness, his very own clumsiness caused him to fall adding to the misery and pain through his resentment, rebellion, and desires for revenge. Oftentimes the adult child of my heart cries in the same childlike way, bruising himself needlessly to defend the questionable dignity of his transient personality and often forfeiting life itself rather than face the indignities of accepting or acknowledging his own immaturity. These wounds and indignities fester in the consciousness of these wayward children of my heart. And in the end, their very bodies sicken and die in the agonies they have imposed upon themselves. At first, in innocence, and then in the arrogance of the personal self, having forgotten entirely their true identity. It was with the first forgetfulness and the first fall from grace that the healing flame from my heart went forth in order that the pain and distress might not destroy my beautiful creation. Thou hast said truly that time heals all. Time heals all. And yet, time is only the agent through which my love and healing flame can regenerate the manifestations of my perfection. Thou hast now the secret of the flame of love from mine own heart with which to manifest once more that beauty and perfection that beauty and perfection which thou truly art and shall always be to me Accept my healing violet fire. Bathe within it the essence of the sacredness, the sacred fire coming forth from me to you and wear thy new garments of freedom. And our prayer for today is In the name of the presence of God, I am in me.
the love, wisdom, and power that is anchored within my heart and that of all mankind. I call to the presence of my eternal now being, my eternal being, my eternal being, to come forth and shine your light in, through, and around me, and allow that light to touch all souls that I may come into contact with. I realize that I am of myself a vessel to do the Lord's will on this planet. And I ask that I may be the chalice of light to bring harmony to every human being and all life on this blessed planet who is in need of an immediate release of whatever they are going through at this time. Through and by my beloved God presence, I act in authority of my own being to make that which is out of alignment into pure balance and harmony, to bring the qualities of precipitation of life in the areas of truth of all things. The supply of God of a thousand suns, the healing radiance and the consecration of this planetary body to be in total alignment. Henceforth, today, I ask that the flame of healing be directed down from out of the great central sun through the temple of precipitation to saturate the entire planet with its pure radiance of healing light to penetrate through us the necessary light quotient that is needed to our entire four lower body systems at this hour. We speak to the air element to assist in the movement of the healing rays going throughout this region of the north, aligning with the angels of the north who are in position to assist us now in the north quadrant of these United States of America to go forth directing those light rays in the south quadrant, the east quadrant, and the west quadrant throughout the entire world. We speak to the earth elements on today to encapsulate the healing rays in each crystal, in each stone or crater whereby the people of the earth drawing closer and closer to these objects are able to instantly receive the healing. We speak to the water elements and those blessed ones who bathe in water, who drink of the water and play in the water of life. that they will be able to instantly receive the healing 
that's needed for their body system. As the healing rays are stimulated to travel down and touch now, we must draw nearer to that which is of the sea. To be so in tune with the water element of the earth to bless us. And we ask that the fire element come closer to the earth through the sun presence of our being to allow the radiance of the sun to flow freely, flow freely, flow, 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 flow freely through our atmosphere and penetrate us with its healing light now. And for the next 30 days, allowing the elements of the earth, fire, air, water, and earth, working in conjunction with the Elohim Cyclopia to help assist the entire planetary body and all life upon her. We thank all the great and mighty Elohim for coming to aid us on today with the healing rays to the earth. Almighty I am. Almighty I am. Almighty I am. Let us now make our heart calls to God presence, the great I am, now and as we pause to allow entrance to the mighty I am presence to enter our hearts and attune with us as we connect to the heavenly realm to guide us each day Ask Archangel Michael to enter our space now with his protection over us. We ask also the Master Beloved Hilarion, Archangel Raphael, Archangel Raphael, come, come, come. Archie Mother Mary, Elohim Cyclopia, and Lady Compliment Virginia and the Brotherhood of Truth to enter our space and commune with us now as you begin to state your personal prayers to these great and mighty beings of light. the great I am presence. State these words in your consciousness. I now joyously accept the fullness of the mighty God presence. I am the pure Christ. I now joyously accept 
the fullness of the mighty God presence. I am the pure Christ. I now joyously accept the fullness of the mighty God presence. I am the pure Christ. I am its presence and full command. And the mighty I am presence sustains and expands itself and conscious cosmic victory forever. I demand the opportunity from my presence come into me, come into me, come into me now. I demand the hand of my presence make the opportunity for me now and open wide the door by which this can be done as the ascended masters or as the presence desires to do it now please do it now I am the law of forgiveness and transmuting flame of every impurity, error, and obstruction I have ever imposed on any part of life or that any part of life has imposed on me. I am the law of forgiveness and transmuting flame of every impurity, error, and obstruction I have ever imposed on any part of life or that any part of life has imposed on me. I am the law of forgiveness and transmuting flame of every impurity, error, and obstruction I have ever imposed on any part of life or that any part of life has imposed on me. Let's just allow for presence to work a mighty work on our behalf on today, filling us with that pure essence of divine love, being able to penetrate through us, and that resolve. As we issue this command of presence and the name of my mighty I am presence. You are the governing intelligence of me and my world. Therefore, whatever this appearance is, this condition is, it has no power. It has no power. Take command and produce your protection, perfection here. Take command and produce your perfection here. I, in the human form, shall be humble and obedient before thy great light and law. No longer shall I allow my intellect to feel dominion. No longer shall I deprive it. Of your power. Flowing through to govern my being. My world. And hold its dominion. It is so done. Thank you, mighty I am presence, for answering this, my every call to you. Thank you, legions of light of the fifth ray and the temple of precipitation and healing 
and all those who came in my space and realm on today to offer your assistance to us. It is so done in the name of the Father. It is done in the name of the Son. It is done in the name of the Holy Spirit and World Mother. And so it is. Beloved I am. Beloved I am. Beloved I am. And our affirmation for today is, I am the healing flame from the heart of my Father, Mother, God, now floods through me, and I am now made whole, happy, and free. I am the healing flame from the heart of my Father, Mother, God, now floods through me, and I am now made whole, I am now happy and free. I am the healing flame from the heart of my Father, Mother, God, now floods through me, and I am now made whole, happy, and free. Allow for that just to marinate and soak all of that up on today. Because if you're like me, you're a bright light in the room right now. And that bright light is the sun presence shining all about you. In closing, please continue to issue your decrees and affirmations for today and throughout the rest of your day. Remember that your light is one with Christ. And you will begin the process of discovery as you realize your divine potential. This is Tammy Dennis with Destiny, the Open Door, and our Spiritual Life Teachings, signing off. Kadosh, kadosh, kadosh. Adonai, say Holy, holy, holy is the Lord God of hosts. I don't I, dear destiny, the open door. God bless you all. Namaste. Peace be with you and upon you. Love and light to you all. Almighty I am. Almighty I am. Almighty.
now manifest on this earth always. I am light. I am light. I am light. I am light. Thank you for your support of Destiny the Open Door and our spiritual life teachings.